the soundtrack of a better world. We are one. Welcome to the Progressive Birdhouse. goodness. Well, I don't know, but I'm glad to see you. Welcome to the Progressive Birdhouse for April 13th, 2022. I am Bird One, and it is once again time to explore strange new worlds, strange new thumping noises. Progressive House, trance, and techno for the next two solid hours. Tribal. Avian Invasion welcomes you.
Oh yes, many, many bird noises in fact. It's going to be two hours of bird noises, I hope you're ready for it. like we've already got well not a hype train but rock pup has called out a random shot this early in and it looks like they want the corgi well i only have one corgi left and that would be the saddle coat vodka so it looks like it's gonna be a teeny tiny bone dry martini courtesy of rock pup That's right, we're getting this out of the way nice and early, aren't we? Oh, thank you very much to those of you throwing in some bits right now as I call out this random shot here, or uh, serve up this random shot. Uh-oh, I just saw the lights change. Ah, oh, boy. Okay, well, I guess we're doing another one. What are we doing back-to-back, -back, my friends? We've got ourselves some corgi, and we've got an engine shot that I now have to pour as well. Which one is that going to be, my friends? Let's see here. It's going to be a double shot. I don't know if I have enough to do two of the Corgi Vodka right now. 
Somebody want to call it? Oh, it looks like the Yoshinagawa Golden Horizon, which I have to find. Ah, there we go. All right. So for those of you that are new here, or for those of you that just simply haven't been paying attention for literally month after month, we have ourselves... Ooh, we have ourselves a DMX controller that quit. Come on, come back to daddy. You can do it. There you go. That's more like it. Okay. So, for those that haven't been paying attention, anytime a hype train starts, we pour ourselves an engine shot. And in this case, this one was provided by Coach Crow during my birthday stream. Many thanks to you for that. It looks like we're doing a double shot back to back here. So, thank you to those of you who have not only started a hype train, but seem to have pushed it. Uh, where are we now? Oh my goodness. Looks like we just busted another level. I have absolutely no idea how far it is, and I haven't been paying attention, so I should probably catch up with these shots real quick. As the show rolls on here, looks like we busted level three, so I'm going to queue up an original track after this. But first, this Corgi's for y'all. Mm -mm -mm. Smooth and soft, just like a Corgi. And following that immediately with some sake. Thank you so much. We are damn near done with level four already, and I'm just now getting to the engine shot. So thank you for your enthusiasm, my friends. Keep it up, and I will keep making music for quite some time. Cheers to you. So since I already have this one queued up, this is another Camilo San Clemente number called Elixir, which is basically what I just had two shots of, so thank you very much for that. The Corgi army continues on screen here, but there will in fact be... Oh, it looks like we just busted level four. Thank you so very much for pushing us over the edge there, uh, uh, Fuzzy Durg, it looks like. Don't worry, I will queue up an original track as soon as this one is done. Goodness, with over three and a half minutes left, and I've barely gotten myself together at the beginning of this stream. You guys have almost broken level five. I haven't even gotten to that original track yet. Thank you so very much for your enthusiasm. I don't know to what I owe your devotion and your bits and your subscriptions, but thank you for keeping this little bird in business. You are currently funding the new music hour, which is going to happen in the second half of this show. In the meantime, little keytar. Little singing. The invasion has chosen Keto.
like we have ourselves a level five within the first two or three songs a random shot and a level five hype train you guys are absolutely going to destroy me it looks like uh oh we have a robot selection for the uh hakutsuru plum line don't hit that one very often i wonder if i can get to that one before i queue up this original track here yep that'll be one shot of vodka and two shots of, uh, well, one shot of sake and one shot of plum wine before I even start singing. <laughs> oh boy, this is going to be a long show, isn't it? All right, let's do this. Still got a less, little less than a minute left. This bottle was provided by Mirage's Hot Date, another birthday gift. It is going to take me a while to go through all of these shots, but uh, as long as you guys keep calling up those hype trains, maybe that won't be the case. So here's to you, my friends. Looks like we got only a few more seconds left here. There it goes. All right. Thank you guys so very, very much. Uh, thank you to Fuzzy Dirk, of course, Aledra Fur for resubscribing, Rock Pup for subscribing uh, five people and themselves. Uh, Aledra Fur, of course, tossing out like, looks like more than 10 gift subscriptions here. Fuzzy Dirk throwing in a whole lot of bits. Uh, at least 12 whole actual dollars worth, it looks like. Uh, Zero Key Wolf for tossing one out to DJ Rekka. Who, by the way, if you're not already subscribed to DJ Rekka, you should also do that yourselves. And uh, Aledrifer is sealing the deal at the end there with another gift subscription. Thank you so very, very much for all that you do. Cheers to you, my friends. Have a little plum in your life. Oh, that is nice and tart, actually. It's rather wonderful. But now, as promised, because of level three, an avian invasion original. This one was specifically called out by Zero Key Wolf, and I guess I will go for it. It's a little track I lovingly refer to as Carnival of Animals. See how well I can actually sing while there's a shot of corgi vodka in me, a shot of sake, and now a shot of plum wine. It's gonna get a little warm in here.
stars tonight And found myself a washing colored light It felt like spirits had awakened me This carnival of animals had taken me conversation going on in the chat right now is downright bizarre. I'm glad you're doing this now, not when my dad was watching. Thanks for that. Also, in the middle of all that, Dick Laser and Joe Hobby wanted some guitar and some original. Well, the one you just heard was because of the hype train. This one, however, is thanks to y'all for paying attention. So, you just came from an original. This is also an avian invasion original.
Thank you once again for calling out the originals and calling out that guitar. You don't have to spend a dime to program the bird on this show. Just pay attention and look at the bottom of your chat at avianinvasion.com slash live. And now we kick it to some Garden State. Yes, not the Garden State, but just Garden State. The Garden State is, of course, New Jersey, where the Corgi Distillery is. I'm running preciously low on the Corgi stuff, actually. Uh, probably only about three more shots of that, so if y'all do any more random shots or hype trains and want to see me kill that bottle, well, that's always a possibility. And that is, of course, fair play. And so is this.
kind of a drink Origami Griffin has poured herself, but she weighs about three ounces, and I'm guessing it's gone to her head because all she keeps saying is, mm -hmm, under fluffies. Under fluffies. <laughs> In that voice. Hey, thank you so much for the, the non-hype train. Give a subscription, Jackal W404. Look at those glorious bird bubbles. Thank you for tossing one out to the family here. from Ciala's comment here that uh, they are enjoying a fine, fine sesame chicken soda. You know, I'm, I'm not here to judge what people drink. Well, hopefully it's as bubbly as I am right now. Because I'm having a wonderful time here on this Wednesday afternoon and I hope you are as well. Of course, this Friday it's going to be something a little bit different. It will be all trance as I take over the channel from Transcension. And I hope you'll join me for that. That one's going to be happening the usual time as the Progressive Birdhouse. And I will make sure that avianinvasion.com slash live points there. But if you want to go ahead and follow Transcension right now, you can do so at twitch.tv slash Transcension. You can see it on the screen there for how to spell it. Or just ask me later. But I'm excited about doing this show, and I hope you're excited to go see it. It's going to be all trance. I haven't done that in a while, and I will probably start doing that again. You see, we talked about maybe moving those Friday afternoon shows. And I'm thinking I might bring back Trance Invasion on Mondays again. Let's, let's mix things up a little, shall we? What do you think? Matter of fact, I'm going to ask you all in the chat. So that means you'll have to tear yourself away from your coffee or your whiskey or uh, your, in, uh, I don't know, your, your machine-like making of blurb shirts. You know who you are. In any case, time for a poll.
Beagle Beagle is suggesting Taco Trance Tuesdays. Uh, I don't want to be in a Taco Trance. That sounds... Uh, that sounds like something I need to take an antacid for. the poll is now live so let me know i'm thinking of bringing back a monday show of course but that show would be i don't know progressive birdhouse or would it be the revival of trance invasion well let's see what happens you can vote right now
right now, that poll is still going on. There's only about uh, a couple of minutes left on that one, but right now it appears that Reviving Trance Invasion has an obscene amount of support. So maybe this will change things back to the way they used to be. The only reason I stopped doing Trance Invasion was not because I fell out of favor with Trance, because I didn't stop loving it or something. Andrew Connix and I were on the road every two weeks, and I couldn't maintain three shows on that schedule. It was impossible. So one show had to die, and unfortunately, Trans Invasion got the axe. So, it, I mean, the poll ain't over yet. Who knows? Just moving the PBH to another day may still win, but there's literally only one dude in this chat who has voted for that. I don't know who you are, but I have the funny feeling that apologies are going to be in order. We'll see what happens. I will tell you this, though. If any of you are uh, skilled video people and want to help me make a cool intro for the Trans Invasion revival, Drop me a line at avianinvasion.com slash discord or slash telegram, or you can email me at avianinvasion.com slash contact. I got an intro for the Progressive Birdhouse, but I don't have one for Trans Invasion. Maybe we can change that. Together. That's the end of the poll, and of course, as you probably expected, literally 92% of the vote, this is like some sort of weird banana republic going on here, 92% of the vote went towards reviving trans invasion, so let's see how quickly I can make that happen. It may even start as early as next week, for all I know. We'll see what my Friday schedules look like, but pay attention. Join me at avianinvasion.com slash join to get on the mailing list. We will announce something soon. Oh no, what did I miss? I tried to do something clever in the middle of all this and I failed. Ah, that's a, yeah, well, let me try that again here. It's as simple as a little typo for avianinvasion.com slash underfluffies. For inexplicable reason, that now goes somewhere.
apparently incapable of typing. I blame you for throwing three shots at me in the first, like, ten minutes of this show. <sighs> oh, forget it. See, now I should be making redirects for under full fees, under full fees, and under fluffies as well. Oh, scrap it. Frozen Fox, the under fluffies are powered by coffee. Apparently I need more. Everybody in the chat right now is absolutely dating the hell out of themselves with the Homestar Runner references. Yes, they just released a new video on April 1st, and oh boy, do they still got it. But yeah, that came out when I was just a wee little bird. Ah, uh, things have gotten cooler in here. Which is, you know, not always a good thing, given that we've had snow, rain, hail, warm sunshine, and a cloud of pollen that makes me think I'm some in some sort of uh, tree hugger's pornography. It's been very weird here in the Emerald City. But I do like it when the studio looks cool and refreshing. Oh yes.
back to cool lights and of course zero key wolf here in the chat room with a shout out spending those seeds of awesomeness saying i hate to remind everyone about the adult activities that we all must do but if you haven't already make sure to file your taxes this week that's of course those of you that are in the states i don't know how it works in other countries do you have taxes in other places in any case the IRS website says the deadline is April 18th this year due to a holiday in D.C. So now, back to the music. <laughs> music. Says the tax man. In any case, it's not just time for music, it's... New music. Join Avian Invasion and explore the hottest new sounds in trance, progressive, and more. Every week. The new music hour begins now. Uh, just a reminder, yes indeed, it has been an hour already. A whole ass hour. A whole ass hour. Who'd have thunk it? And of course that also means it's time for the new music hour. That hype train that you all started within the first like four seconds of the show starting. Stuff like that pays for all this brand new music week after week. So thank you so much for helping not just support this show, but to every one of those artists out there who's making this music. We're starting with something brand new from, uh, uh, I'm going to need some help with this pronunciation, but Charisian? Charisian? You got me on that one. You can look at the screen or you can join me at avianinvasion.com slash mixcloud or slash Spotify once the show is done. Take a look at the, uh, the set list for yourself and let me know what you think. In the meantime, enjoy this hour of brand new progressive trance and techno. Also, thank you so much, Frozen Fox, for those bits and for making it blue. So very blue.
are beautiful. You are not alone. Free your mind. a new producer while I was looking for some new tracks. Somebody named Fatal Error. And do not ask me to spell that one. You're just going to have to look at the screen. Oh, look. Yeah. They're so clever. They're using, like, numbers and stuff instead of letters. Well, I'm guessing that's how you pronounce that name because I'm not going to spell it out one letter at a time. But this is good. It's time to respawn.
By the way, to Grelaton for hitting that tip jar. Very much appreciate that. I've been buying a whole lot of weird shit lately. Things that are going to keep me grounded, for example. As a matter of fact, there's an uncomfortable amount of gigantic wires now taking up a lot of my studio space. I've got like 300 feet of two-gauge wire. I just got a big old wooden spool in the mail, no less, of four-gauge wire, and I've got this here for the grounding. Who'd have thunk that actually properly wiring a studio would take so much heavy metal, even if I'm not making heavy metal? So thank you so much for your help in affording all of this, because, oh boy, uh, it's not cheap right now. Very much appreciated. We're going to put all that in the ground sometime soon, hopefully when it's not hailing. Ugh. Sooner or later. In any case, the new music continues. Thank you all for your support on those as well. As a matter of fact, we're kicking it over to Harry Diamond with K-Mark. Something called Orbit which is always a fun place to be. have lost track here, but I'm not sure what uh, y'all are counting here in the chat. It certainly isn't shots, that's for sure. I've only had three so far. And that is carefully regulated. Mostly to keep you guys from killing me. Not that you would intentionally, but you know, things can get out of hand. After all, Rock Pups started the show with a random shot, and then we hit a level 5 hype train. Y'all are insane. Avian Invasion.
very much for the bits there, Frozen. Always appreciate it. One thing that I've tried to do during this show, week after week, month after month, with your support, is to try and expand my library quite a bit. As a matter of fact, I'm branching out into other... It's still four on the floor genres, but I have taken a liking to techno simply because it is a jackhammer. Most techno tracks basically hit hard, keep hitting hard, and stay there until you can't take anymore. It's a wonderful, wonderful way to drive things home. And so on that note, here's not Chuck D, but Charles D with Heavy. Avian Invasion. I just saw the lights change. All aboard the hype train. All right, I guess here we go again. So the question is, what is that engine shot going to be? Once again, every time a train starts, we do an engine shot. Every time it breaches, uh, sorry, it breaks level three, I queue up an original track, even in the middle of the new music show, the new music hour. And of course, if we break level five, well, a caboose shot follows. And it looks like the Johto Yuzu, chosen by Takala Macrowolf, is going to be our first engine shot this time around. Thank you so very, very much. Let's see how far we can kick this train off the rails. This is Avian Invasion. the tiny but mighty origami griffin that introduced me to Johto Yuzu. It is lemony and delicious. And this is our engine shot for this hype train. If you're drinking at home, well, remember to drink responsibly. Be safe. Have a sense of taste, of course. Don't drink garbage, even if you are a seagull. Here's a toast to you. Those of you jamming along at home, and those of you that might be in your car listening in, I know you can't type, but keep your eyes on the road, keep your ears on the bird, and thank you so much for your support. Cheers! this hype train we have a shout out from Ms. Art the Everlasting saying play some industrial music I dare ya well I don't have any queued up unfortunately so well I mean the sounds of a train rolling by will have to be as industrial as we get I'm no Trent Reznor sorry to say but thank you so much for pushing it past level 2 now or sorry pushing it past level 1 we're now into level 2 with Jackal 404, Rock Pup, and uh, Akasuki? Akaz uh, I don't know how to pronounce that one. There's a lot of numbers and letters. But we're already more than halfway through level two. And this train keeps on rolling.
left and we are at 86% of level 2. Of course the new music continues unabated. There is plenty. As a matter of fact Elon Bluestone just released a, uh, a remix album. Now a lot of this is, uh, you wouldn't call it new music but they are new remixes. This one is actually a Gid Sedgwick uh, uh, sorry this one features Gid Sedgwick on the vocals and this is a prof extended mix so that I can't remember how long ago he released this one, but it is one of my favorite Elon tracks. Paid for Love. The train continues and so does the new music for at least another half an hour. Thank you for joining us here in the Progressive Birdhouse. Somebody's checking their speaker cables right now. It's coming back.
Jackson. We are stuck in mid-level three, but that's quite all right. I'm just happy you guys started this hype train at all. We'll see how far it goes, but the new music hour will continue all the way to the end regardless. Thank you guys so much for those of you who have been chipping in this whole time. Oh, and thank you, Rock Pup, for kicking it along a little bit further there. And coming up next is something from Harry Diamond, Steve Smith, and Kmar. Sorry, K Mark. Just killed level three, so it looks like I'm bringing up something which is French for an original track coming up next. for making fun of my inability to speak my own native language. It gets difficult sometimes. seconds left on that hype train and we are steaming towards an original track an avian invasion original this is one i released a few years ago it's called sundance and believe me 
Here in April in the Seattle area, we are rooting hard for that sun to come out. It can get a little shy around here. 45 seconds to go. Let's see how far this train goes. Apparently it goes past level four. Thank you very much, Elendrifer. minutes left and we've hit Cyan. There we go. Thank you so much to those of you who pushed it past level three. That was an original track. Like I said, that was Sundance. You can get that at avianinvasion.com slash Sundance. In fact, and it looks, uh oh, I just saw the lights change again. Hang on a second. Caillou and Albert would like a word. Oh, uh, yeah. Looking at the chart here, you know what that means. With only 30 seconds left, we've hit all aboard the hype train. Hype train. Level 5. Oh, uh, that's it. We still got 20 more seconds, but thank you, Wildcard9, for kicking it into high gear. 
I mean, trains don't really have gears. They just have torque. It's kind of a linear curve, actually. You know, forget it. In any case, it looks like Impestry is calling out the next one. It's going to be the Murai Daiginjo, followed by a little bit of Kitar. And there she blows, my friends. So thank you so much, Siala, for tossing one out to uh, the Chaos Crew Leader, Zero. Impestry for giving the bot one, in fact. <laughs> Rocked up for tossing some uh, gift subscriptions out there. Zero Key Wolf for tossing one out there. Allegra Fur and Wildcard 9, both for tossing out four or five apiece. I cannot thank you enough for your generosity, your support. I swear to God, whenever we have that beer bash this year, it's going to be a crazy-ass party here. But as for now, the new music continues unabated. Thank you so very, very much. Time to cue up that shot. Now, where the heck in my sake library did it go? Yes, this one was provided by Mirage's Hot Date. Another Saki from the uh, Murai family. This is their Daiginjo. Thank you so much for pushing that train past level five. If I can get the bottle open, I'll drink to you. So far, we've had one random shot and two level five hype trains. I cannot believe. I can't believe how friggin' wild this show gets. Thank you so much. I wish I could fit you all here in the studio to dance along with me, but it is a tiny little apple crate. However, I am building something bigger out in the backyard. So thank you so much for your help making that happen week after week after week. The opening party is going to be epic. Cheers to you, my friends. Stay strong. If you're partying at home, try not to break anything. If you're partying elsewhere, well, still try not to break anything, but I guess you can feel a little less bad about it. In the meantime, cheers to you. Griffin 07, not the other six Griffins before them. And uh, again, Ak has his uh, AK-47 suck one. I, you know what? It, you're going to have to tell me how to pronounce that one. Between the two of them, they want some singing and some guitar. I might save that for the end of the show, just so we can get through some more new music. In fact, this is more from Fatal Error. More interesting spellings. A little track called Lost. A KD remix, though. Fairly solid, if you ask me. Thanks so much for supporting the show, y'all. This is Avian Invasion.
invasion has chosen Kitar. That's right, we got more coming at you from Elon Bluestone before I go anywhere with original tracks. Again, this one's another remix from Zijaro and Pitch. I, I've never known how to pronounce that one. Somebody help me. Thank you very much, Essel 7.0. 
for saying I have an early Daft Punk vibe. I'd rather have that than a late Daft Punk vibe. I, I, I like to show up to the gigs on time. Thank you very much. Love is a drug and I feel it in my bones tonight. Oh, this city, it brings me to life. No, not enough and I'm holding on for greater heights. Oh, this city. says greetings from VR chat. Well, I would say tink tink, but I think all the drinking is done at this point. I mean, I, I could be wrong, but the hype trains are certainly over at the very least. And once again, I can't thank you guys enough for throwing two of them at me like every single show. Seriously, it's absolutely incredible. But now, thanks to your incessant seed spending, and of course, Zero Key Wolf's incessant asking literally every single show, it's time for a little bit of a shanty. That is the end of the new music hour. It's time for some really, really old music. An avian invasion original. The 
say a pirate's life for me. But pirates of what century? Are there corsairs and sailing ships? Or torrent trading little ships? From P to P or the high seas? Will there be blood or NFTs? Don't make anonymous upset. Thank God I haven't crossed them yet. Are they peg leg with parrot pets? Or basement rats afraid of sex? Somewhere I think they missed a step. They don't look like Johnny Depp Yo ho ho Is there nowhere left to go And the booty calls Does anybody know Yo ho Sail away Set a course for Pirate Bay Cause the last pirate's fighting With the MPAA Yo ho Is there nowhere left to go And the booty calls Does anybody show Yo ho Sail away, send a course for Pirate Bay Cause the last pirate's fighting with the R.I.A.A. Hey, thank you very much to Jay Colley 719 for calling out a random shot Well, nothing stopped them in their tracks God knows they've tried to patch their cracks With DRM they can't decrypt Maybe a disc that can't be ripped There's blood on everybody's hands Oh shit, I think we killed the fans And this bottle was donated by Coach Crow on my birthday show Yo ho ho, is there nowhere left to go? And the booty calls, does anybody know? Yo ho Sail away, set a course for Pirate Bay Cause the last pirate's fighting with the MPAA Yo ho, is there nowhere left to go? And the booty calls, does anybody show? Yo ho Sail away, send a course for Pirate Bay Cause the last pirate's fighting with the USA Yo ho ho, is there nowhere left to go And the booty calls, does anybody know? Yo ho Sail away, send a course for Pirate Bay Cause the last pirate's fighting with the MPAA Yo ho, is there nowhere left to go And the booty calls, does anybody show? Sail away Cause the last pirate's fighting The last pirate's fighting The last pirate's fighting with the R I And that is going to do it for this episode of the Progressive Birdhouse. Thank you so very much to all those of you who have tuned in to whoever Yo-Ho-Ho is for hitting that tip jar with 25 bucks at the end of the show here. There's still a lot more electrical stuff to buy to make this new studio an actual studio, as well as lumber and drywall and paint and all kinds of other crap. So thank you so much for throwing some money into that tip jar. Of course, there was an Ask Me Anything at the end from Boolean263 saying, Have you caught the attention of the group mentioned in verse 2 since this dong song, since this dong debuted? I don't know. I'm not talking about you, little ding ding. Uh, no, uh, I have not. Oh, uh, ding ding down. Oh, okay. Oh, 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 well, it has left. The ding ding has left the building. No, I have not caught the attention of the RIAA or the MPAA. I am an obscure little robotic bird in this little apple crate here in the Emerald City. And so without any further ado, I bid you adieu, and I will see you 8 a.m. Pacific time for the early bird breakfast. Some deep house, some organic house, some fresh coffee, and weather permitting, I might even do the show outside, but don't hold your breath on that one. It's been weird around here lately. In the meantime, I have to leave you once again with a giant robot voice. And of course, courtesy of Tori the Bear, who wanted one last dab here at the end of the show. Of course, I'll be in Atlanta, Georgia in less than a month. I hope to see you for my return to FWA. In the meantime, 
I'll see you Friday. Thank you for listening. This show only exists because of dedicated patrons like these. If you want to hear more, The Invasion needs you at avianinvasion.com slash Patreon. Look for Avian Invasion on Spotify, Mixcloud, YouTube, and everywhere dance music is sold, streamed, or enjoyed. Remember to like, subscribe, and share. Until next time, Bird One reminds you that you are alive, you are beautiful, and you are not alone. All right, it's time to double the size of Trans Jesus' audience. Say hi for me, y'all. <laughs>